What's up everybody, Kingsley Breaks here. A little late night break, a little after hours. We're going to do a little hit draft uh, with between Dube and Kev in Breakers, splitting a box of Premier Hockey. This is what they called the monkey box for some reason. I don't know why, but this is one of the last boxes that Dube did not finish in a case. So I wrote, by me, Dube, as you can see. Drew a little stick figure that has nowhere to look like a monkey. <laughs> but they wanted to split it because they feel like there could be something nice in here. So they split it. So what we're going to do is just open up the box, showcase the hits, and then we'll randomize the two names. Customer right number one we will get first pick, and so on and so forth. I hope there's a champs auto first card in here. <laughs> oh, man. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to title it the monkey box hit draft. All right, guys. Good luck. It's a Gretzky sign tan. Imagine that happened. Damn. So, if that were to happen, right, let's say that would have happened, you guys could have chose the tin first, right, before you chose any card, which would have been crazy. Right, I'm going to use this blank to kind of cover up the hits. The 10 is a hit. I'll send you guys a 10. Hopefully, it goes to do Bill, so it's in the United States. <laughs> All right, so Tage Thompson. You got Barber Chef to $3.99. <laughs> So I'm covering this. We got Tuck to three ninety nine. What the hell is that? All right, let's go to the hits. Good luck, guys. First one is a John Gillies. To 299. A little two color, a little snug and a little white right there in the corner. We have Logan Couture. That's not bad. What is this? Ink script. Theorem Flurry. 19 of 49. Never seen an autograph like that. Alright. Before I pull this next hit. What box was this from again? Was this Dube's box where he got the where he got the Besser, the McAvoy, right? Is it this is the same case, right? This is the same five box enter. That's why he didn't take it. Right? This is why he didn't take it. No, but the Keller came out in the second half. But I'm saying the Keller came out in the second half of the Master. So that has nothing to do with this inner case. This is the inner case that had the Besser and McAvoy together, right? The last box, you were like, nah, I'm good. I'll save that one for another time. Because Joe P is saying yes. Keller was in the second half of the same master. Right? Interesting. I mean, I, I, I kind of peeked at this. I wish the patch was a little bit better. Oh, it's a nice patch, but look at that. 37 of 99, Nico Heischer rookie patch. So, damn, this was a nice case. This is a solid inner case. 
Think about that. Two out of one ninety nines, then you get a he shirt three color to ninety nine. Monkey box guys, it marinated. <laughs> it marinated. I think we can go back to it, but this is the box that Dupe didn't do because he's like, I think I killed it already. I don't want to do it. But then we were like, no, you have to do it because there's probably some nice hits lying in there. All right, guys, so there you go. This is going to be very interesting now. This is going to be very interesting. Scared money, man. Don't make money. All right, so Heesher to 99, three-color patch. That's nice. Well, actually, four colors, right? Or no? Three colors. D.O.N. Florida 49, Ink Script. Got Logan Couture. John Gillies, two color patch at $2.99. Tuck, $3.99. Barber Shows at $3.99. And Tage Thompson, Relic, at the top. So basically, I think Kev is saying is that whoever gets obviously first pick is going to take the Heesher, right? And then second pick gets the Flurry and Gillies. I think that's kind of fair, right? Just because one's going to get that card and then do that. So you guys want to do that, so for sure. And then the rest you guys can you guys can bid on. So we'll, we'll do these together. And then that one like that. And then there's the two base relics. And then the two numbered cards. Is that what you guys want? No, I know. I'm just saying, though. So we can do that. So somebody's going to get this, or somebody's going to get this. <laughs> Basically. And there you go. All right, then. Let's do the randomizer, then. Whew. All right, so I did it what you guys wanted. Dice roller right there. Randomizer. That should be ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there you go. We're going to dice roll it now. What's going on with random.org? It's not, it's not moving. It's stuck. It's stuck. Come on, random. There you go. All right, two and a three, five times. There you go. Five times the names, five times the dice roller. All right, good luck, guys. One, two, three, four, and five. Five times. Do. And numero uno. Then it goes down. That was close. They, they were both. They were both going five times. <laughs> Let's double check. There's the five. All right then. Well, there you go, dude. But you're still here. <laughs> the Heesher to 99, three color, or the Theo Ren to 49, and the Gillies two color patch. Watch him be like, I want the Theo Ren. I want the Theo Ren and another one. <laughs> Let me know. Final answer. Nineteen of forty-nine. There you go. Ink script. Gillies is a goalie. Goalies always sell pretty well, right? And if he actually does play very soon in the near future, it could be like Soros or something. It's a little bit of white, or yeah, it looks like a little bit of white at the top. And then the Nico T shirt of 99. No ink, of course, but nice three color patch, and it's 37 of 99. <laughs> it's 
So what is your answer, dude? I showed it right now. <laughs> I just I just showed it. You see it? Are you looking at this? There's a two color patch. Just let me know what you choose. But if you guys are watching YouTube, guys, you guys could just, that's it. You don't have to worry about this part no more. Unless you guys want to stick around to hear what I, what Duke tells me what he wants on breakers. The jersey again? Uh, what do you mean? Over here? Couture, Cage Thompson. And you got Barbershop Tuck. Yeah, I just showed him, Kev. Are you, are you guys not seeing this, or is it just me? I can see myself perfectly. I'm looking at my breakers, and you can see the jerseys. Logan Couture and Tate Thompson. And you got Barbershev to 399 Tuck. And obviously, you guys know. Okay. Let me text this dude. Alright, well, I'm going to end the video, though, at least. You, I'll give you guys time to decide. But, hey, guys, if you're watching on YouTube, this is a pretty nice box. I still have one box left for personal, if anybody wants to do it. But we can do it another night. I'm going to run already. But there you go. That was a nice little fun break. Pretty nice hits coming out of the box that people thought there was going to be nothing in there. So, there you go, guys. Thanks for watching.